Maryville University hosted the second annual Forensic Science Day, which is a partnership between Maryville University faculty, uh, Rockwood School District, and St. Louis County police officers and detectives that came together today on Maryville's campus to showcase the career of a forensic scientist and what the kind of realities of being a forensic scientist are. We highlighted some different aspects of forensic science, working from the beginning of potential crime all the way through trial, in the middle of forensic science analysis where you analyze evidence, you look at, you see whether or not you have a particular drug, whether or not you have a flammable material, uh, tire tracks, uh, match up possibly, footprints, fingerprints, uh, you know, and just to name a few, there's a lot more evidence possibilities there. And what they did in the lab is they analyzed for flammable materials using gas chromatography. They also analyzed for uh, illegal materials via absorption spectroscopy, talk about internet uh, crimes, talking about how, how data is stored on computers and how uh, hard drives are searched. And we do it as an opportunity to uh, make people aware of forensic science because it's important for people to, to grasp the entire concept. If you don't grasp from beginning to end, you're not going to be able to understand why you're doing analysis. And you know, for that forensic scientist, that's critical. Well, the thing that we can do here at Maryville that I can't do in my classroom is meet with all these professionals in one day. So having the students being able to see multiple individuals in who are working in forensic science and give them an, as uh, an aspect that I can't give them. I've never worked in forensic science. I can teach them the book part of it, but what they can do here is show them the real life aspect of it.